Hi Aries, and thank you guys for tuning into my channel. Please keep in mind that my readings are general and may or may not resonate. So, take with us, leave the rest. Also, please be sure to check your sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign for more insight. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys would like to book a personal with me, or just get a $10 question and answer, everything that you need is going to be in the comment section. First card out, forgiving and learning. It says, as you release the past and heal, you experience more love in the present. Let your friends help you. It says, ask and accept support from others. And pay attention to the red flags, the signs of caution in you. Bottom of the deck, true love. This is a romance of a, lo a lifetime. So this is definitely someone that is teaching you a lesson, okay? I feel like this can be a karmic. Yes, this person does really love you. However, you are supposed to learn from those fucking red flags that this motherfucker keep flashing in your face, okay? Yeah. Here you are. Mean as shit. Standing in your energy, though. Sitting there, wishing the bitch would. Yeah. Could be a Sagittarius that you wish and would try you. But I see you trying to balance out the situation because you know this motherfucker is a player. You like, I will beat your ass, but I'm not. Because, you know, I could just leave you. Because me, I'm going to be all right. I don't know why I keep... I was about to sing the whole song by Beyonce. Me and my baby, we going to be all right? <laughs> like, I feel like you like, oh, I'm over. You're enraged, though. It's a lot of yellow here. You're mad. You're like, yeah, cold, detached. you like, fuck this. I'm over it. This person pissed you off. What, what happened, spirit? What happened, spirit? Somebody says, it's my baby father. <laughs> I feel like, look, four wands twice. Something happened in this in this stability. Something happened in this household. Something happened. What happened, spirit? This person might have left to go venture off somewhere else. Or you might have found out that this person was cheating on you. Yeah, they moved on. They didn't tell you why they left. This person might have just left you or broke up with you, but they really were going to go fuck with somebody else. Yeah, I feel like that took you off balance. That had you out your seat. You didn't even know what to do. The emperor usually has shit under control. This fucked you up. Yeah, I felt like it became stagnant and you were waiting for this person to come back. You're single now. Yeah, but this person is too toxic for you. They broke your heart. This person, look, King of Swords twice. This person is very, being very cold towards you. And you might have done nothing but, but been loving and caring towards this person. Or, you know, this could be how this person treated you. This is a general. Take it how it resonates. Okay, so let's see what the outcome is. Spirit, what is the outcome? What is the outcome? For Aries, Spirit, please tell me what the outcome is for Aries. Spirit, please tell me what the outcome is for Aries. I see you holding back from this person, going with your intuition and ghosting this motherfucker. Like, I don't have to talk to you. Good. Yeah, I see you working on your money, waiting for something better to come in, but definitely not talking to this person no more. What is your advice, Spirit? You need to make a decision on what you want to do moving forward. Don't let this pain that this person caused you stop you from dating, seeing what else is out there. I feel like you're at a part right now in your life where you like, fuck it all. Okay, so I want you guys to think of one question. I'm going to answer it for you. One question, you guys. It says, meditation brings answers and no. Okay. All right. Thank you, guys.